automated here. And we don't have to worry about uh, high water temperatures causing digestion problems for our goldfish anymore. But now, we don't need to worry about the temperature differences between day and night, which can easily make them sick. As we all know, goldfish are cold water fish. You don't have to keep temperature consistently at 28 or 30 degrees like tropical fish. However, if the temperature changes more than 4 degrees within 24 hours, the goldfish's immune system can weaken and they might get sick. That's why many goldfish keepers still use a heater, not to make the water warm, but to keep it stable. For example, if the temperature is dropping, I like to set my heater about 2 degrees below the highest water temperature of the day. This helps keep things nice and steady. Alright, now let's talk about today's main topic, itch or white spot disease. White spot disease usually happens when the temperature fluctuates too much and the fish's immunity drops, giving external parasites a chance to attack. At first, you might not see white spots on every fish, but the weakest one will usually show symptoms first. If you don't treat it, it will quickly spread to others. Each is caused by a parasite called Ichisophia smetifilis. It forms small white cysts on fish skin and feeds on the fish's nutrients. But there's the good news, these parasites also have a temperature range they can't survive outside of. Below 10 degrees or above 28 degrees, their larvae stop developing and die. They also can't tolerate the salt. So when you notice white spots, you can raise the water temperature a bit and add some salt. Both are gentle and safe methods for goldfish. Keep in mind that treatment targets the lime, not the other parasites. So it usually takes about 3 to 5 days to fully clean up. And don't worry if you see more spots in the first couple of days. That's just because they are still reproducing. Once the cycle breaks, the white spots will disappear. Sometimes, though, the parasites can be stubborn. In that case, you can use muscling blue for a 20 minute bath treatment. Usually, it works by the next day. Personally, I'm not a big fan of using strong medication on my goldfish. That's why I focus on regular water changes and keeping the tank temperature stable. And if your goldfish does get sick, don't panic and start pouring in multiple types of medicine. Always identify the symptoms first, then treat accordingly. If you truly care for your goldfish and observe them every day, you'll have plenty of time to find the right solution. Just don't make sudden changes to the water or temperature. It will stress them out and could even make things worse. Thanks for watching today's video about goldfish. If you find it helpful, please give it a like and a subscribe. See you next time.